second episode of The Reordered Universe Explained. We are starting with the fantasy adventure, adventure novel Percy Jackson and the Sea of Monsters. Published in 2006, it is the second installment in the Percy Jackson and the Olympian series. The book follows the adventures of Percy Jackson, a demigod son of Poseidon. The story begins with Percy realizing or discovering that his best friend, a satyr, Grover Underwood, has been kidnapped by an evil cyclops and that Thalia Grace's pine tree, the one that protects the camp half blood, the training ground for demigods, is dying of poison. Percy, along with his friends Annabeth, Chase, and Tyson, a young cyclops and Percy's half-brother, sets out on a quest to save Grover and retrieve the Golden Fleece, which has the power to heal Thalia's tree. Their journey takes them through, through the treacherous sea of monsters known as the Bermuda Triangle to mortals. Percy and his friends must save the day yet again. So this time guys, we won't need a character study because um, they are the same characters except for a few. So I thought we could do that after the plot summary. So let's begin with Tyson, Percy's half blood brother and a young Cyclops. Now, contrary to popular belief, all Cyclops are not bad and Tyson is actually a good one, a son of Poseidon and thus Percy's half brother. He is really innocent and really sweet. Annabeth is not fond of him at first, but time and time again, he proves his loyalty to Annabeth, showing her that he can be trusted. And we also have Polyphemus, the Cyclops that kidnaps Grover. He is an evil Cyclops who is almost completely blinded by Odysseus. And he... And Percy and, and, and Percy and her, his friends have to defeat him to get the Golden Fleece. And also, I want to add Clarice LaRue. She was also in the previous book, but not that much. She is the demigod daughter of Ares and a mortal, though her mother is not mentioned and that is basically what Clarice LaRue is she is exactly like her father really like happy and she's ready to fight at all times and she has a genuine hate for Percy but it slowly grows into a trust bond and yeah, that's it for today. And until next time, I'm your host, Ella Davis. See you in the next episode. Thank you and goodbye.